this video, we'll study about evaluation of triple integrals. So, given a problem, evaluate minus 1 to plus 1, 0 to z, x minus z to plus x, min x plus z, x plus y plus z, dx dy dz. First point, we have to note that here, the limits are functions of x and z. So, therefore, we need to evaluate this integral first with respect to y. So, let me take a given integral as i is equal to minus 1 to plus 1, 0 to z, x minus z to x plus z, x plus y plus z, rewrite this as dy, then dx dz. With respect to y, the x and z are treated as a constant. So, therefore, integrating first with respect to y, we have the limits minus 1 to plus 1, 0 to z. Here, x and z are both are constant. So, I will consider that as one term. x plus z is the constant. Integration is y plus the integration of y is y square by 2. And this is evaluated between my x minus z to x plus z dx dz. So, here minus 1 to plus 1, 0 to z, x plus z, the limits of y are the upper limit x plus z minus the lower limit x minus z. And here for the second term, it is x plus z the whole square minus divided by 2 x minus z the whole square divided by 2. On simplifying the first bracket, it is minus 1 to plus 1, 0 to z. In this case, the x and x get cancelled. We have z plus z is equal to 2z. So, it will be x plus z. Here, the x with the multiplication of minus sign, it will get cancelled. And minus minus it is plus z. So, we have 2z plus and on expansion of x plus z and x minus z. So, here 1 by 2 will be a common. Expand this by using a plus b the whole square formula. So, the expansion will be x square plus z square plus 2xz minus x square plus z square. Here it is an expansion using a minus b the whole square formula. It is dx, dz, the next orders of integration, minus 1 to plus 1, 0 to z, multiplying 2z, so it will be 2xz plus 2z square. Here it's 1 by 2. On multiplying the minus sign and simplifying the x square and x square plus z square, it will get cancelled x square plus z square, so it will be minus minus plus we have 4xz dx d dz. Now again, the cancellation of 2, this limit will be minus 1 to plus 1, 0 to z. Here it will be 2xz, 2xz plus 2xz, it is 4xz plus 2z square, it is dx dz. Integrating with respect to x, it is minus 1 to plus 1. We have 4z as a constant. Integration of x is x square by 2 plus in the second term, the z square is constant. 2z square is constant. So, therefore, the integration will be x and that is evaluated between 0 to z dz minus 1 to plus 1 it is 2 z the x square value is z square minus 0 plus 2 z square here it is z minus 0 dz so that will be minus 1 to plus 1 multiply that z square with the 2 z it will be 2 z cube and here also it will be 2 z cube dz. So, the integral 
फोर जेड क्यूब डी जेड नाउ इंटीग्रेटिंग विद रिस्पेक्ट टू जेड इट इज फोर जेड रेस टू फोर डिवाइडेड बाय फोर बिटवीन माइनस वन टू प्लस वन द फोर गेट कैंसल्ड वन रेस टू फोर माइनस माइनस वन रेस टू फोर इज इक्वल टू वन माइनस वन इज जीरो सो देर फोर द वैल्यू ऑफ द गिवन इंटीग्रल इज आई इज इक्वल टू जीरो A similar kind of the example will solve. So here we have to evaluate this integral. So note that we'll take the given integral as i. So i is equal to zero to one, zero to root of one minus x square, zero to root of one minus x square minus y square. It is x, y, z. Note that the the limits are a functions of x and y. So when the limits are the functions of x and y, our order of integration should be a z first. So it is z. Now here the limits are a functions of x. So out of that dx and dy, these are the functions of x. Means the next order of integration will be with respect to y. And zero to one are the limits of x. Integrating this with respect to z, so zero to one, zero to root of one minus x square. X and y, both of them are the constant. The integration of z is z square by two. So the limits are zero to root of one minus x square minus y square dy dx note that 1 by 2 is a constant so we'll take it out of that integral side 0 to 1 0 to root of 1 minus x square x y it is root of 1 minus x square minus y square the whole square minus 0 dy dx so the square and square root get cancelled for the next order of integration the x will be a constant so therefore i'm going to group this as 1 minus x square and minus y square separately so that will be 1 1 by 2 0 to 1 0 to root of 1 minus x square so this multiplication i'll write it as x it is 1 minus x square into y x y into 1 minus x square minus that x y into minus y square it will be x y cube dy dx integrating this with respect to y so x into 1 minus x square will be a constant it's 0 to 1 x 1 minus x square is the constant integration of y is y square by 2 minus here x is the constant the y cube integration is y raised to 4 by 4 between 0 to root of 1 minus x square dx on substituting the limits It is one by two, zero to one, x one minus x square. Here, root of one minus x square, the whole square divided by two minus x root of one minus x square is to four divided by four. And the lower limit for both the terms it is equal to zero. Cancelling. The square and square root. Here, the square root is half. One by two raised to four will be a square. So we have one by two, zero to one, x one minus x square. This is also one minus x square divided by two minus x one minus x square raised to square divided by four. Yes.
Note that 1 minus x square, 1 minus x square, it will be whole square. So we can take x, 1 minus x square, the whole square as common. So it is 1 by 2, 0 to 1, x, 1 minus x square, the whole square is common. So we are left with 1 by 2 minus 1 by 4, it is b. So on simplification, it is 1 by 2, we will get 2 by 8 which will be 1 by 4 which is taken out of the integral sign. So 0 to 1, expand 1 minus x square the whole square. So it will be x 1 plus the 1 x square the whole square will be x raised to 4 minus 2 x square dx. Multiplying that x inside the bracket 0 to 1 it is x plus x raised to 5 minus 2 x cube dx. On integration 1 by 8 0 to 1 integrating this with respect to x it is x square by 2 plus x raised to 6 by 6 minus 2x raised to 4 by 4, 0 to 1. Substituting the upper limit, 1 by 8, it's 1 by 2 minus 1 by 6 minus 2 by 4. So, 2 by 4 is 1 by 2. So, 1 by 2 and 1 by 2 get cancelled. The value of the integral is 18 to 6, it is 48. So, it is 1 by 48. So, therefore, the given integral value is 1 by 48. Thank you for watching.